What up, y'all? We're back with Skyrim playthrough number 33. My name is B. Ritt, and we are going to our house for a little bit, and then we're going to go and start the Golemai quest line where we follow him around to the East Empire Trading Company. Um, please leave a like and smash that subscribe button, and uh, we're just going to get started here. And uh, thank you for watching. Honor to see you again, my fame. Of course. What room would you like me to furnish? Very good. I'll make all the arrangements. Many hours later. Talk to Gaiman if you want a horse, or Catla if you're looking for work. I can't help you. I hate it. Everyone feels sorry for me, so they don't treat me too bad, but... Both my parents were in the Legion. There was an ambush. Catla said she'd feed me if I could make myself useful. I'd take care of the animals, run errands, that kind of thing. I guess it could be worse, but... I'm sick of sleeping outside with the horses. I want a real home, real parents, not this. Really? Do you, do you have a place I can live? Uh, oh well. Thanks anyway, I guess. Position. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Might consider joining up myself. You should tell her that her uncle is scum that betrayed his high king. Best she know now, Advar. They're all hard. Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Torig. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't Traitor. deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric Liar! Story. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such is our way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords! I go to Solemn Guard. Good riddance to bad rubbish, I say. This should have drawn it out some more. He deserved a slower death. Not right now. Rogvir, why did it have to be like this? 
man opens a gate and they cut his head off? Doesn't seem right to me. If you're heading to the Blue Palace, you might want to rethink that outfit. I'm a little busy at the moment. I got also. You look like an adventurous one. I bet we're kindred spirits, you and I. I still can't believe he knew what he was doing when he opened that gate. Seems there's always more to be done. So, what do we have here? Hmm, let me guess. By your scent, I'd say you were from the guild. But that can't be true, because I told Mercer I wouldn't deal with them anymore. I don't deal in land or property. Now if you're looking for goods, you've come to the right person. Oh, wait. Did you say Golden Glow Estate? Uh, my apologies. I'm sorry to say I know very little about that uh, bee farm, was it? Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I can't be expected to remember every deal I handle. I don't care what you promise. If I tell you the buyer's name and word gets around, it can ruin me. Well, now that you mention it, there is something I've been trying to get my hands on. I have a buyer looking for a case of Firebrand wine that just so happens to be a single case in the Blue Palace. Bring it to me and we'll talk about Golden Glow Estate. This one's a favorite of mine. A legend we all know and love. Our hero, our hero, claims a warrior's heart. I tell you, I tell you, the dragonborn comes. With a voice-wielding power of the ancient Nord art. Believe, believe, the dragonborn comes. Good evening. If those white run gods can take down the dragon, so can we. noises and lights. We need someone to investigate. Then we will immediately send out a legion to scour the cave and secure the town. Hafengar's people will always be safe under my... Your Eminence, my scrying has suggested nothing in the area. Dragonbridge is under Imperial control. This is likely superstitious nonsense. Perhaps a more tempered reaction might be called for? Oh, yes, of course, you were right. Falk, tell Captain Aldous I said to assign a few extra soldiers to Dragonbridge. Thank you, Jarl Elisif. But about the cave? I will have someone take care of the cave as well, Varnius. You can rest easy. You are dismissed. Do you? I am the Jarl Steward. If you have court business to tend to, you talk to me. You mean the Dragon Bridge issue? I'll be honest with you, I was planning to let that go. There have been reports of weird happenings near Wolfskull Cave. Travelers disappearing, odd lights. I suspect wild animals, or perhaps bandits. I don't think it's worth our time with the war going on. But if you want to clear out the cave, I'll 
make sure you're repaid for your work. The cave has a bad history. Long ago, Potema the Wolf Queen used it for necromantic rituals. That's where it got the name. That was over 500 years ago. Nothing much down there now. But everyone's always convinced the cave is haunted. Feel free to return to me with questions. The Blue Palace is an open forum. <coughs> From the Bard's College here in Solitude. Wanderers like you should think about applying. Ah, I see. Good. Here, take this. I certainly can't use it, but I suppose I need to pay you something for the goods. Not at all. I consider it an investment in prolonging my life. As far as Golden Glow Estate goes, I'll tell you what I know. I was approached by a woman who wanted me to act as the broker for something big. She flashed a bag of gold in my face and said all I had to do was pay Arangoth for the estate. I brought him the coin and walked away with her copy of the deed. Not at all. I tend not to ask too many questions when I'm on the job. I'm sure you understand. However, I did notice she was quite angry, and it was being directed at Mercer Frey. In this business, we rarely deal in names. Our identity comes from how much coin we carry. We drink to our youth, to the days Look, that's come all I know. I never promised you I'd have all the answers. Now, since our transaction is done, we'll I'll be on my way. And restore what we own With our blood and our steel We will take back our home Our business has concluded And you're standing in my way On the day of your death We will drink and we'll sing We're the children of Skyrim And we fight all our lives And when Southern Guard beckons Every one of us dies I know you can afford a septum or two. Crowd's fire manor. Now there's a fine home. A for sale too.
All right, so we just followed Golamai, and uh, we made our way to the beginning of the East Empire Company warehouse. So we're just going to end that here, just so we don't make the video too long. Um, please hit that like button, ring that subscribe bell, let us know what you think in the comments below. We do appreciate you guys coming by. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I think I already mentioned that, but thank you for coming by. Bye!